What's going on guys? I'm excited to share this video with you today. We are going to do a what's in the bag. We are gonna talk about the clubs, the equipment, and all the details. So, let's get to it. So first off, we are going to start with the iron. So the irons currently are five through nine, are precise and fives. They do have a steel shaft with the red flags. I should get a forearm, don't have one currently, but I will get one. Probably will replace them maybe in the future, but for right now they do the job and uh, we'll get it done. That's it for the irons. All right guys, next up is the uh, wedges. So right now only have two of the wedges out of the four that you probably should be using. Right now I only have a pitching wedge, 46 degree and a 50 degree gap wedge. I should get a sand wedge. I know, I know. We'll probably end up getting one, but for right now, they do the job and uh, I like them. So first is the pitching wedge. The pitching wedge is a 46 degree. It is old. <laughs> the pitching wedge uh, I've had for a while now. It is a stiff flex steel shaft. Um, don't use it very often, but hopefully we will get into some situations where we might take this club out. But for right now, it kind of sits in the back. Next up is that uh, 50 degree wedge. The 50 degree wedge I use quite often. It is a uh, reg flex shaft with a steel shaft. Probably we'll all switch to uh, steel stiff shafts eventually. All right, so we got the hybrid now. got the Taylor made Sim Max 2 hybrid Ventus blue shaft stiff shaft 70 gram shaft I love this club only got to try it a couple times but for the times that I did it's performed great if you guys have the chance you got to get this in the bag next up is the five -way. Would, honestly I don't use that much because it is the old uh, precise club that I came with the club set reg flex shafts so it doesn't do me too well with the long clubs don't know if we'll be seeing this club too much this season but it is in the bag just in case all right guys so excited for this club the driver sim max to D draw driver. It is a stiff flex air speeder shaft. We got 45 gram regular loft setting, 10.5 degrees. Might switch it out to that Ventus type shaft with a heavier weight. Haven't had the chance to use it much because there is four feet of snow on the ground in Canada. Can't wait to get to use this in the uh, season coming up. Very beautiful. If you have a chance, grab this club. All right, guys, we got the putter. I've had this putter for about 20 years. This putter has done me wonders. I know it's not your typical Scotty Cameron or anything like that, but whatever works for you, right? I will also post the yardages on the uh, screen up here, just for you guys asking um, for all the clubs. All right, guys, so the golf balls I like to use are the Callaway Yellow Super Soft. golf balls are because of my eyes. I can barely see white balls in the middle of summer just because my eyes are hard to see distance in the sky with white and blue. When we put a yellow one for some reason I can see it better and I get the super soft because I like less spin and I like the feel when putting with it. Great ball, definitely uh, keeping these in the bag. We got the golf glove here. The golf glove, just typical uh, FJ golf glove. 
It is a decent golf glove. I like it. Standard golf glove. Recently purchased, we have our range finder. Yeah. Yeah. Now the range finder is just your basic range finder right now. I believe it is laser range finder. It goes up to 500 yards and uh, very excited to use this because I haven't had the chance to use a GPS or range finder that was accurate. So looking forward to it. All right guys, so that's it for what's in my bag. Looking forward to this 2022 season and we'll see you guys out there. Take care.